right, create, create insert drills. Basically, I'm going to use the term profile function to do this. Uh, I believe the rules are for custom cutters, holder has to be a closed loop, one color, and the inserts have to be a closed loop, fully trimmed, as another color. So what I'm going to do is come over here to my levels, and I made a new level, and the first thing I'm going to do is go get my holder. So I go change my color to blue. Any, any dark color will work. Okay. I like I like come over here to my wireframe. Let's do a turn profile. You, you grab this holder because it's gonna it's gonna turn it and hit the high spot, and that's what the software wants. Tighten this up right here. See this one tenth. Make them tight. That's usually the failure. So I'm gonna spin this holder. And it's gonna give me my my close. Well, it's not gonna be a closed loop because it's on center line, but it will give me. My outside holder, see. So now I'm going to go up to my home key and change my color to yellow. Do the same thing. Turn profile. Get my insert. Go get the next one, which is this insert. Now some of this needs to be trimmed up. Uh, since there was a hole in it, we don't need this or this. Okay. Uh, it looks like this cross center line, so I need to trim this, this line up with this line. This is my insert. Go to my trim function, trim to, trim it out. Okay. Go back to my home key, make sure I get a blue. Draw my wireframe. I'm going to press E because I want to go to the end of this line. Take my F9 off to show my... And really, I'm just going to go trim it. Trim U. Trim U to U. Done. So now we have inserts one color, overlapping. The holder is one other color, overlapping. Let's go back to our tool paths, right click. Uh, let's go do a drill. Okay, right click, create a new tool. This is a custom tool. It's on level 51. I say draw the tool. So basically it revolved it, and that's what you're gonna get. Okay, give it a give it a, a number, tool number 20, whatever it happens to be. Speeds and feeds, save this to your library. Now, when you create it, it shows it up under, we don't know what it is. So take your tool filter off and go find it. There it is right there. Give it a depth. There's your impression.